Looking at a live picture, this is Incline Village, uh, where they've got rain down at the surface, starting to see some snowflakes fly as we get up to elevation. And by the way, Lake Tahoe itself expected to have three to six foot waves as this storm passes by. So it's going to be a very snowy Saturday, followed by a nice sunny Sunday, and then a little bit more snow on the back end of that on Monday in the afternoon. So if you're already there, great. If you're not already there, not a great time to be going right now. So one to three feet above 7,000 feet is what we're expecting. You can see we do have the winter storm warning and winter weather advisories that are up above uh, 8,000 feet we could see up to five feet of snow new snow wind 50 mile per hour gusts could be happening and if you get up to the ridges you could take that up to almost 100 miles per hour so it is the typical Sierra storm that's going to be rolling in that means that you kind of need to stay put until things settle down so here we are you can see kind of the rain the light rain in the bay but there's some of that snow in the Sierra that's starting right now and it really is just getting started it is the beginning of it it'll pick up as we get later into the evening Evening. Light scattered showers around the bay right now. We too are going to see things pick up, but right now it's mostly just cloudy skies, a little bit breezy out there. Uh, and, you know, not bad if you need to get some errands run before you kind of settle down for the night. Here's Futurecast to show you some of those heavier showers rolling their way in. There's five o'clock, so I think we're going to have that unfortunately sloppy, messy commute. And this is the overnight where you see the heavier showers rolling in, particularly the early morning hours. That's 5 30 a.m. Uh, that's going to be kind of the bulk of the heaviest rain. By 1045 we'll start to see some clearing from north to south by the time we get into our evening now we're looking good that is New Year's Eve so there's 630 notice the clouds start to clear just in time for the fireworks so hopefully we'll have a good run with that and then a beautiful Sunday just really clear and sunny as we get into Sunday for our first day of the year so your New Year's Eve plans should be just fine we're gonna be clearing out as I mentioned I think by six o'clock we'll start to see you know no more rain in the Bay Area and start to get some of those clouds to move out as well temperatures in the 40s and 50s but between now and then we've got a lot of rain coming our way so we're talking upwards of an inch and a half in some spots up in the north bay we could see more than two inches of rain coming down very quickly so just be ready for it we are under a flood watch that goes through saturday afternoon because some of this will take a while to kind of ramp down and then we've got this parade of storms next week we've got a couple more coming the one on monday doesn't look that strong but the one coming wednesday and potentially later in the week does look like it will be a bit stronger so your break will be saturday night through sunday and then again we have that system that's coming on monday here's a look at your extended forecast to show you uh, some of that rain that rolls through so we do get that break on sunday Sunday, and then we do have rain rolling in again as we get into next week. So starting off the year with a little rainfall, Stephanie.